Good evening, this is KIMT Storm Team 3 meteorologist Travis Clark Smith coming to you on your Saturday evening around 6.30 p.m. Golf preempted our 6 o'clock show tonight, but I did want to get a brief forecast out for you. Right now around the area, temperatures are in the low to mid 70s, 71 degrees in Rochester, 72 in Austin and Charles City, 73 in Albert Lee, and 75 in Mason City with generally partly to mostly cloudy skies. Charles City actually at mostly sunny skies right now. So we had that rain earlier this morning and the clouds through most of the afternoon. We have slowly cleared out and things are looking good for your Saturday night going into Sunday. Although we might have some fog going on tonight into Sunday morning. Your headlines looking over Albert Lee right now. Pretty much dry overnight tonight. We'll have sunny skies continuing through the day on Sunday, but changes are coming. We're looking at some strong storms possibly overnight Sunday into Monday. The majority of those storms, strong storms, will be further to the west, but it is possible that some of those strong storms could make their way into our area overnight on Sunday night. So we will definitely keep an eye on that for you. Let's track things out by six o'clock tomorrow morning. We're looking at some dense fog, mainly towards the Mississippi River, but some areas further west of the river could be seeing some fog, especially over Fillmore County, into Mitchell County, Howard County in North Iowa. But that will clear out by around nine o'clock in the morning. And Clouds will be on the increase through the day, but we can expect to see sunny skies for a good portion of the day before we see some showers and thunderstorms starting to make their way through later on tomorrow evening into the overnight hours. We have a chance of storms right around 9, 10 o'clock, and then that main line of storms will be passing through in the wee hours of the morning on Monday. So if you're thinking about doing some lawn care, Tomorrow and Wednesday are likely to be your best days. Monday and Tuesday might still have a chance to get some of that in, but with the rain in the forecast, might not be ideal conditions for that lawn care. Now here's a look at our severe weather risk for Sunday. Most of the stronger storms will be further off to the west, but we do have a level one risk mainly west of Highway 63 for a few stronger thunderstorms along that low pressure trough. And the main threat will be damaging wind gusts. So we will be on the lookout for that and we will track those storms for you and let you know what you need to know to keep you and your family safe. Taking a look at that seven day forecast where your weekend is always in view, even though I have on here Thursday and Friday is the weekend. Forgot to turn that off in the graphic, but hey, First part of the week looking kind of active with some showers and thunderstorms, mainly in the overnight hours, Sunday into Monday, and then again at Tuesday into Wednesday. Warmest day of the week looks to be Tuesday at 80 degrees. And then we're going to cool down back to around normal for this time of year with temperatures in the upper 60s to around 70.